Welcome to Embracing Ratchet. And I love and like to all. Thank you to everyone that's like, share, subscribe. If you guys have purchased a reading or donated to my page, thank you. Okay, we have dreams. You need to pay attention to what's going on in your dreams right now. Uh, the divine may be trying to tell you some things, may be trying to show you some things. There's a moon here. So they may be trying to get you to understand some things that's going on around you. You need to pay close attention to your dreams. Make sure that you have a pen and a paper next to you uh, before you go to sleep. Okay? Wake up. When you wake up, whatever it is that you remember, write it down. You want to also make sure that you're going to bed with a clear conscience. You know? There may be someone from... Um, one of your deceased loved ones may be visiting you while you're while you're sleeping as well. Okay? So, you know, they may have something that they want to talk to you about or, or show you or, you know, something of that nature. So, please, make sure that you're paying attention. If you guys are having a hard time going to sleep, um, you know, try, like, some chamomile or something of that nature. might be able to assist you Scorpio Scorpio Yeah Some of you guys may be having nightmares right now Um because of some burdens and some hardships and some lessons that you're still learning. Spirit of the cross, burden, hardships, lessons, spirit of the moon, cycles, visions, dreams. We have dreams out here twice. Dreams. <clears throat> Guys, there's a cycle that you're not putting down. There's something that you're not stopping. There's something that you're not learning. I need you to go back through. I need you to look at everything that's been going on with you. If you're thinking about a relationship, I need you to go back through it with a fine-tooth comb. I need you to let the divine know what, what you've learned based on that situation. I need you to understand that you need to acknowledge to the divine, to the universe, God, source, spirit, whomever it is you pray to, that you have learned your lesson because I see a cycle here that is not ended. I see that there's some bullshit still going on that you don't know about. And this could be causing you some nightmares or, or some trouble sleeping or something going on with this because you do feel the burden. It could be the burden of someone else coming towards you. Okay? Trying to continue this cycle, right? But you guys have got to get to a point where you're ready to cut this this shit in half. Cut it, you know, cut it off. And I don't see that here. Yeah, see, I got 10 of swords, right? Somebody stabbed you in the fucking back right here. Somebody gave you them burdens, that bullshit. Yes. Page of wands, queen of wands, okay? Meaning that you guys have had to elevate a bit. Nine of pentacles and king of cups. Okay, so somebody here wasn't showing their full hand. They show it wasn't showing their card. There's being a little bit manipulative. To me, as a reader, when I see King of Cups, this is someone that don't want to show you how they feel. This is someone that doesn't want to give you the real. So for me, they're very manipulative because if you don't want me to know what your emotions are, then you, you're not real to me. Okay, so with this Ten of Swords here, 
Yeah, this is some, some bullshit. Somebody can have Gemini in their chart. This is the end of a cycle, okay? Right? This is you guys making it to an end of a cycle. Now, we know with a 10, there's a new beginning that's supposed to come behind this, right? And with the Page of Wands, that's exactly what this is, okay? A new beginning, right? Somebody that's ready to embrace and explore other things. Someone that's not trying to stay in the same bullshit. Someone that wants to do something different. Someone that's getting good news, you know, playful, optimistic news about something after they went through this turmoil over here. This is someone that's full of ideas, full of enthusiasm, ready to do the next thing, ready to do something fun, ready to live their life and go on a new adventure. This is also somebody that's young, could be immature as well, could be a child for some of you. This could be one of your children or this could be you. Okay, some sort of message is on its way to you about somebody that fucked you over. Okay, this is what's happening. And this is already a burden to you guys, right? The cycle ended here. But what I see up here is that someone's not trying to let this cycle go. With the Queen of Wands, Pisces or Aries, right? Someone could have Pisces or Aries in their chart. Usually this person is 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 um, a warm person, somebody ambitious, somebody flirty, somebody funny, right? Someone um, could be, you know, have a bad temper. Um, but it, it's somebody that basically, you know, know, knows what they want. Queen of Wands, passionate person, right? This could be you too, right? Nine of Pentacles, this is... Being single, this is um, enjoying being single. This is enjoying your life. Somebody could be Virg uh, have a Virgo in their chart. This is uh, financial in independence, someone living their life, someone's fulfilled, someone's doing the things that they want to do, okay? Someone is living the way that they want to live, right? Yes? Someone also may be expecting But this King of Cups is what bothers me here because I feel like this is the person that could be trying to come back. <sighs> could be a Libra. Could also be you, Scorpio, right? But someone wants to come back and give you a little bit. They're not trying to give you all of themselves. And they're not trying to tell you everything either. Not with this uh, King of Cups. And if this is you, Scorpio, okay? This is you uh, when this person does come back at you. This is you standing in your essence, right? As a single person, not taking the bullshit and just in your in your moment, like... I, I'm not dealing with this. Like, I'm not doing this with you. I'm not biting. I'm not giving you what you want from me. I'm not telling you what you want to know. I ain't doing any of that because I'm done with you type shit. Yeah. And doing it very passionately, by the way. Yeah. But I do see something happening here. Ten of Swords, Pages of Wands. Ten of Swords, Page of Wands, Spirit for Scorpio. Thank you. The Tower. Yep. And you know it. You know this person's coming back towards you. You know we have the tower and the high priestess. You know this person's coming. You know already. I ain't got to clarify no more. You already know this because you feel it. And if they, they may have contacted you already. 
They may have said something to you already just to test the water. Okay? But if y'all ain't here for it, I don't believe you are. All right? Listen, guys. Sending you love and light. You guys take care.